Okay, 2045 Winfield Avenue. We'll walk into the main area here. First thing I see here, obviously, is a window unit. Uh, there are registers on the floor. They could be just for heat, so we'll definitely double check to see if there is central air or if it's only the central heat. Uh, wood floors here in the main area. And there's a combination of linoleum and tile, stick tile, um, final tile uh, throughout the house here. So as we walk into the kitchen area here, pretty small little kitchen area. Definitely the idea of redoing some, getting a little creative in here. Um, probably is a good idea, but wouldn't cost too much even just to redo some stuff that's in here. It's actually not in bad shape, um, but definitely could use some resurfacing. This little area here, it's probably good for a cafe style table. I don't wouldn't make too much changes here. Although if you wanted to do something to increase the pantry size or something like that, certainly I, I, I get that, but not a real huge benefit um, to be honest with you from what I can see. And we've got our back access, back door access, and our basement down here. We'll go down to the basement here um, in just a little bit, assuming we have electricity and ability to get down there. Let's head on over to the bedrooms so we can see what we see. Closet here, bathroom here. Good sized, um, or standard sized three piece. But pretty dirty. Just assume it replacing everything in here. Bedroom in the back of the house. Wood floors are, look actually really nice and I'm not seeing structural concerns. We got some built in shelves back there. So it feels really nice and curious as to what's under these flooring, if it's this wood, because this wood here is actually in excellent shape, to be very honest with you. I mean, a polish and you're good to go. So maybe in, um, you wanna replace this, these floorings, this, this and what's in the kitchen. But man, this wood flooring here is actually really nice condition. Uh, bedroom at the front of the house. So we've got a two bedroom, one bath. Again, good condition. Well, I mean, the house actually is really in, in good condition. Um, overall, from what I can see. I'm not having any real concerns uh, structurally. Most everything is cosmetic. A little bit of an odor in here, um, but nothing that's really just throwing me way off. All right, let's see what this basement looks like because I have a feeling this is the, the thing that is really going to do it for us. Now, I'm going to go down here. The light's not working from what I'm seeing, so I'm not sure what, what we have down here. All right, I'm going to have to go get my flashlight because there's no light down here. So let's do a quick walk through the outside. But again, interior here, it really looks good. Not, not concerned at all. And the interior side, it's really just cosmetic. All right, let's see what we've got here exterior-wise. Vinyl siding around, French porch here. Obviously not in the greatest of shape. Probably just pull that down. You could maybe do a, something extra on top of it if you wanted to. You could probably even shave it down a little bit. I mean, uh, sand it down a little bit and repaint it. It's not bad. Siding here looks pretty good external sides of the window so those it's the original single pane windows but we do have storm windows so not bad and they're aluminum on the outside wood on the inside um, judging from the back side of the house here for the uh, roof roof looks to be in good condition newer flashing the vents are newer as well a newer style look to be in pretty good condition Backyard, fully fenced in. Nice looking two car garage. 
roof for it is actually in pretty good shape as well. I mean, really, <laughs> it's like all of these awnings here are, are for, throughout the house are really the only thing externally that gives me pause. And man, that's easy stuff to fix. But externally, this looks really good. Foundation are just these cinder blocks, something I'm not real concerned about. And again, as I was walking through the um, outside of the, or the, on the inside, there's nothing really that was causing me any concern whatsoever. Good view of the roof over here. Again, looks in good shape. Definitely a five, probably 10 years left. I'm not seeing any real, you know, you got your typical wavy stuff here for a home of this age, but nothing that's giving me any real pause over here. Let's walk over here to the AC condenser. So at least there is a condenser, so we know that there is central AC. It just may not function. It's definitely, it's pretty old. All right, so take a look at those numbers. If you're interested, let us know. Um, and I can get you some more information on the on the basement and what that looks like. All right. Thanks a lot.